Hi, in this example, we're going to talk about how to use EM Pro parameter sweep and optimization for a 2.45 gigahertz uh, monopole on a PCB. Uh, this was tested in EM Pro 2021 update one. Before we uh, start the optimization and parameter sweep, we need to install the optimization toolkit. This can be done by using the menu tools, add on manager and then browse to optimization toolkit and then turn that on and once you, once that's done uh, click the ok button so this will turn on the optimization uh, routine for this session um, an archive the em pro workspace for this example you can download it from the keysight knowledge center and um, an archive using this menu right here once you're in archive, you should see this uh, layout for this uh, PCB monopole antenna. The parameter that we're going to be sweeping and optimization is called L underscore monopole. And that can be seen here in the parameters tab, L underscore monopole. And for uh, seeing this on the layout, click on the edit monopole modeling sequence right here, monopole modeling sequence, and then double click on the sheet body. And then you can right click around here and then say edit position. And this shows the formula for um, the position um, on the V coordinate f and how you use the L underscore monopole parameter. So, the next step is to uh, do a parameter sweep. You can click on the FEM simulation setup tab here. And then um, go to the setup parameter sweep and then turn that on. And then you can uh, specify L underscore monopole 17 millimeters to 23 millimeters right here. And then switch to the frequency tab and look at the frequency sweeping from 1 to 5 gigahertz. And then at a single point at our design frequency of 2.45. So once this is set up, you can click create in queue. In this case, we're not going to do that. The simulation has already been done. So once the simulation is done, or while it's progressing, you can go click on the simulations uh, window. And then if you notice here, um, this, these are the, the results for the parameter sweep. We're running five simulations. And then uh, this shows the results for each of the parameter right here and once that's done we can then open the, the data display for the parameter sweep from here this one here and this shows the output the radiation efficiency for five values of the parameter l underscore monopole that we're sweeping and then we notice uh, approximately at um, at this uh, point here which is a 23 millimeter uh, L underscore monopole the value is uh, around 98.395 percentage for the radiation efficiency next uh, we are going to be doing an optimization of the same parameter in this case uh, click on tools optimization toolkit and you should see this um, dialog box uh, pop up. In this case, I've already pre populated the values. So you can click on this plus button here. And then once you do that, you can browse to the parameter called NL underscore monopole. Set the current value to 20.7, the minimum to 17, and the maximum to 23. And then for goal, you can set a maximum radiation efficiency, set the frequency to 2.45. And then for the method, uh, there are various methods that you can use. In this case, we'll be using the first one. Set a relative tolerance of 1 and then a maximum duration of 15. And then click on the Optimize button. In this session, we'll not be doing that because the optimization has already been done. So once you click the Optimization button, you can uh, see the first value of the optimization in the simulation window. You see here, L underscore monopole is optimizing 20.7. In 
in this case it's already been done so you see the results um, or, the, or the progress of the optimization um, step right here and you see the subsequent optimization step so once the optimization is done um, you should see this window pop up called EM Pro optimization succeeded and you see here um, it says uh, our maximum efficiency of 98.2 uh, with the parameter of value of 22.1 so this kind of um, kind of uh, brings us closer to the parameter sweep value of 23 millimeters and if you do a parameter sweep at uh, let's say 22.2 you should probably see the optimization uh, pretty close to uh, this value right here so that concludes uh, this example again you can go um, download the file from the knowledge center thanks